Uh, I don't think we need to prepare for anything. Uh, probably reposition a bit. Uh, oh, that'll do actually, that. Okay, let's fight. Okay, uh, yeah, we've got a trinity of magic, but we've got no mages here. Basically, I think it's wind beats fire, fire beats lightning, lightning beat. No, it's fire beats wind, wind beats lightning, lightning beats fire, I think it is. Don't have to worry about f that for now, though. How much damage? 27. We need softening up first. Lance is good against him, so let's soften him up with a lance. By the way, something I forgot to cover last part. Or oh, part before and part before that. <laughs> right, if I just get it out of the way. If you go across and you've got skills, some characters have skills. Soren's got Adept, that allows him to do two attacks instead of one at rare occasions. Uh, Riz has Serenity, which halves his biorhythm effects. So, mate, right. Titania has Counter, sometimes if she takes damage, the enemy will take half of it. Shinnan makes enemies attack him first, I think, or... Oh no, that's if he attacks somebody, they attack first. Anyway, uh, we'll put Titania out because we've got a lot of axe people coming up. Either equip her with the hand axe that she can counter the upcoming archer, or the iron axe so she doesn't get the archer, but she gets rid of some. Right, Ike was given the Regal Sword, very handy for him, and very handy for this stage, because a lot of enemies in this stage are wearing armour, and the Regal Sword's effect is it does more damage to those wearing armour. Um, I was going to check, oh yeah, any items? Right, that soldier drops his lance, and the boss gives you a javelin, and that guy gives you a steel lance, so only two slots free. Yes, yeah, so Ike's got to be careful here. Anyway, let's have Soren finish this guy off. If he misses, we'll just have Shin and Fire. Soren's actually a pretty good character. He starts off really bad, but he gets really good pretty fast. Right, um, yeah, that'll do. Iron Bow. Yeah, and Ike will take as well. Ah, let's go with. Yeah, let's go with that for now. Missed me. Okay, I think this is a safe distance away. Yeah. So Soren as well. Yeah, Soren and Whistle die in about one hit, one or two hits. So you have to be pretty careful with them. Yeah, Gage is a great tank. He's good for helping weak people, so if you stick him with Sorin, you can train Sorin pretty fast. Sorin starts off, like I said before, really bad, but he gets really good really quick. At least that's what I've found anyway. Ooh, critical. Um.
Okay, our turn now. Um, 9 HP, 11 HP. Damn, I do 6. And, oh, 7 times 2. Guess someone will finish this guy off. Yeah, it's good because Solin doesn't get much defense, but he does get a lot of speed and a lot of magic very quickly and resistance. So he might be weak defensively, but he's got good evasion and good attack. And good attack power with his magic. That's yeah, so those two taken care of. Now for these guys. Let's see if there's any that Ike struggles with. Well, that long range one will be a problem, so let's take him out. Yay, level up! Come on, good level up. Hey, strength, skill, and speed, my favourite three. Eleven times two. <coughs> yeah, still ants. Titania's always leveled up. Uh, I think I'll lure the archers out. Lure some of the enemies out. <laughs> You're so obvious here if you need to heal anyone. If you feel like training him, then just heal minor, wo minor wounds. <laughs> 